So if you need to solve this angle, <coughs> um, it's a right it's a right triangle. So uh, right angle trigonometry is your friend here. Okay, uh, these abbreviations means you can use sine if you have if you're working with the opposite and the hypotenuse. You can cosine if you're working with the adjacent and the hypotenuse, and tangent if you're working with the opposite and the adjacent. So we're looking for x. We have the opposite of x, and we have the hypotenuse. You know, if you really want, you could use Pythagorean theorem to find out the third side. But with what we have right now, we have opposite, and we have hypotenuse. So sine is our guy. So we've got sine of some angle x, we don't know what that angle is, it equals the opposite divided by the hypotenuse. So now I have something to solve for x, and really you're almost done here because uh, the only way you can get x by itself is by using that key on your key on your calculator, the sine to the negative first. And if you punch this in like this with parentheses, calculator should be able to give you that value. That is about 53 degrees.